You're listening to Dean Michael here on True Radio, the home of proper good music and proper good interviews. And tonight, we're very, very lucky to have a very good friend of mine on the show with us this evening, Mr. Ian Robinson, all the way from Liverpool originally, all the way from um, Manchester, where he lives now. But uh, we Stockport. have great... Stockport, that's right, Stockport. Yeah. <laughs> we had uh, some great times in, in Benidorm. Ian, welcome back to the show. Uh, thank you. Thanks for having me. No problem, no problem. So we, we've spoke about all the old days and everything and what we got up to and uh, our Thursday nights at the Wookiee. And let's talk about Black Lace now, how that all came about. Do you remember we got the phone call from the BBC? And yeah. uh, they wanted us to come over because it was like an anniversary of Agadu, wasn't it? Do you remember? Yeah. And what, what I remember we... on the thing for the, for the news channel, didn't we? On the, is it um, Channel 5 News, we had to go to the school. That's right, we did. We went to the school to to, uh, to to entertain the kids and we didn't think they'd know it, did we? That's right, yeah. And what happened was we got to the school, if you remember, and they all knew it, didn't they, how to do the, the dances? We, it was brilliant, it. absolutely <laughs> brilliant. <laughs> and from that, we kept coming backwards and forwards to back from Spain to England to do the adverts. We did the easy we don't, well, we, Richard, Remember Richard and Judy show? Oh, yes, we did Richard and Judy, didn't we? And then we did We've the done that with Equalizer. We did it with who, sorry, Ian? The Equalizer, Edward Woodward. Edward Woodward, that's right. Yeah, so we yeah. Did. yeah and, he was his, on. and his wife, you remember his wife? She was in uh, 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 some some mothers do have him, wasn't she? His wife. Yeah. 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 yeah Betty, she was, she was she played Betty, yeah, yeah, that's yeah. right. And then we and were then, what was the lady called? Is she Shaper Shepherd? What was her name? Shaper 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 Shepherd. Yeah. Shaper, 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 yeah. And the impersonator, Alistair McGowan, is it? Yeah, Alistair McGowan. There, we were all on there, weren't we, on that show? That was the final. And do you remember when we had to make the pineapple uh, cocktail on the uh, Saturday kitchen <laughs> <Yeah>. thing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That was good. That was, good that was good fun. That was good fun. And then obviously we made the the video because with it being the anniversary, we they wanted us the record company wanted us to do. The Agadu Man Boy, if you remember, so we recorded that one, and uh, we got Bruce Jones to come out and direct it in Nalbia. That went well for the Zumba classes, didn't it? It did. It did. We had all the Zumba classes and everything. And we had a bit of a resurge, didn't we? So after doing that, we did the Walkers yes. Crisps advert. We met Gary Lineker. Yeah. He was yeah. he was lovely, wasn't he? I, th I think we'd done the train line before Walkers, didn't we? Yeah, the train. Choo choo choo. Do, do, yeah. do, come on and join the train line <laughs> and then we did uh, Walker's Crisps and then we got invited to do the Ant and Dex birthday party the joint party didn't we what a night that was <laughs> wasn't it wasn't it everybody in the audience if you remember you felt as though you knew didn't you yeah because when we were sitting on, on stage you looked out and every you know everybody in the audience all famous people when they were all congruent, and they all, all the stars were going past, slapping our hands. And then when we done Agadu, I turned around, and Cheryl Cole was between us. We're like, this is just surreal, you know. <laughs> what I was she got up and did Agadu yeah. with us, didn't she? That's right. Yeah. Yeah. And then, and then there was like, um, there was oh, what was it? now? There was loads of them, weren't there? We we got to meet afterwards, and we were having photographs with everybody. Who, who sticks out in your Holly. mind? Who sticks out in your mind, Ian? Holly will be. Holly. Yeah. They were lovely, weren't they? Yeah. They were <laughs> Holly lovely. will it be, yeah. Yeah, they were lovely. Happy times, oh, Ian. Happy times. So in the future now, we're going to be doing some shows together still, aren't we? Now we're back in the UK. We're going to be, we, you're in a group now called The AIM, which you do quite a lot in Blackpool, a trio, yeah. a whole trio. And um, I'm going to be joining you on a few of those shows um, in, in weeks to come. Yeah. So I'm looking forward to that. And um, you're also doing some of the stuff as well. You're recording, you're making some recordings. And I believe you're making a new album, Ian, of all the, the people that you've worked with. I'm, I'm just, yeah, I'm just at Duo's album, yeah. It's um, it's going really well. It's going really well. I've had, um, I've had Vince Hughes today, winner of Stars and Rise. He's been round recorded. Um, Ace and Elliot. Yeah. Emma, who we used to work with in Spain. Yeah. The lads out the aim. You yeah. yourself, myself, you, yeah, you've been around, well, recorded one. 
and it's going to be a, an album of all the uh, memories that you've people that you've worked with. So we're looking forward to hearing that. Yeah, I've got Tracy May coming around. She was um, one of Shane Ward's back and singers. She's uh, she's doing the Brian Adams one with me. When you gone? That he done with Mel C. Oh yeah, yeah, fantastic, yeah, yeah. wonderful. Well, good. we're all looking forward to hearing that. I'll be playing that for you, Ian, when it comes out when you've got it all finished. Oh, nice. But what I'd like to now, what I'd like to do now before you go, because I'm going to play one of our songs that we did in the town together with the elderly brothers. It's a song. Oh, yeah. called, it's a song called "I Believe." Do you remember that? No, I believe. Well, I believe it's the theme. You used to rub on yourself on injuries. <laughs> oh, oh right, yeah. It's about the batch clears, isn't it? The batch clears. <laughs> the batch clears. <laughs> Originally. <laughs> yeah. So Ian, thanks ever so much for being on with us tonight on True yeah. Radio. Can you introduce the song then for us tonight for, to finish off with? Yeah, ladies and gents, thanks for listening tonight to me, myself and Dean. And um, to finish my part of the show with you, it's a song me and Dean recorded. We used to finish our show with it every night in Benadon. It's The Bachelors, I Believe. The Bachelors. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> thanks, Ian Robinson. Thanks for being with us. You're welcome. Thanks a lot. <laughs> 